The only way to knock down the O'Malley-Brown stranglehold on our economy and freedom and elect three great school board candidates to stop Common Core on November 4 is a huge voter turnout here in Carroll County. After that, it's hard to get motivated. My supporters have told me many of our good candidates were defeated. Why? The problem was big machine government PACs encouraged party switching and collaborated to pump in money and manpower from outside of Carroll in a low turnout June primary, electing their hand-picked recruits. I have filed as a writing candidate, so you have a choice. The statewide MSEA, who backs the O'Malley and Brown tax and spend agenda, brags on their website of winning four of the five Carroll Commissioner seats. With research, I learned this is a liberal strategy across the nation to defeat candidates who, like me, believe that the best government is less government. My record shows I will stand firmly against new taxes like the rain tax and government overreach like Common Core and Plan Maryland's septic bill. Government union websites rail against those who favor cutting taxes, deregulation, and privatization. That's me. As a write-in, my goal is to raise awareness on this strategy, which undermines our democratic process. If government unions decide who wins elections, the people's voice will not be heard, and we will no longer be a nation of the people, by the people, and for the people. Write in Robin if you want to send the message to these unwelcome invaders with pots of government money that they cannot choose your commissioner in District 1. Choose the button that says Write In on the District 1 Commissioner page. A keyboard appears. Simply type in Robin or Robin Frazier. For more information, go to robinbartlettfrazier.com and tune in to Carol Confidential at lwrn.net from 5 to 6 p.m. on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Write in Robin. It's the right thing to do.